Welcome back to Dino World. Your totally non-AI run source for videos about dinosaurs and other prehistoric life. Now on with today's video. Today I'm going to be talking about the oldest known dinosaur, and that's not a typo. It's not the oldest dinosaur, it's the oldest known dinosaur. The oldest known dinosaur is called Nyasasaurus parringtoni, and it lived in what is now Tanzania, Africa between 240 and 245 million years ago. That's about 20 million years before the next oldest dinosaurs, which are from Argentina. Nyasasaurus was a sauropodomorph, which means it was a small plant eater that walked on two legs. It had a long neck and tail for reaching leaves high up in trees. But its front limbs were shorter than its back limbs. This suggests that it may have been able to walk on all fours at times. But probably not for very long or very well. It also had teeth in its mouth instead of leaf-shaped teeth like many other early dinosaurs had. Nyasasaurus was discovered in the 1960s by paleontologist Alan Charig. He found some bones in a quarry near Lake Nyasa, now called Lake Malawi, in Africa. Charig thought these bones were from an early mammal-like reptile called Lystrosaurus. But they weren't quite similar enough to be sure of this. So he sent him to another paleontologist named Robert Parrington to study further. Parrington looked at them and agreed with Charig that they were from a different type of animal than Lystrosaurus, but he couldn't figure out what kind of animal they were from either. So he decided to name them after himself. And so Nyasasaurus Parringtoni was born. In the 1970s another paleontologist named Donald Brinkman studied Nyasasaurus and found out that it wasn't related to Lystrosaurus after all. Instead it was related to other early dinosaurs like Eoraptor and Herrerasaurus. Brinkman also found out that Nyasasaurus wasn't even the earliest known dinosaur. There were older ones than that. But those are for another time. 